Hi <laughs> guys, this is the wild apartment <laughs> in the Texas Panhandle. <laughs> and my kids, grandkids are with me and I'm trying to get them down for bed and it's been a long stressful day. <laughs> some days I can handle stress just fine and some days not so good. But anyway, I'm good and thank you for prayers. My daughter-in-law and my niece are both getting better. And <laughs> director grandson Red is fixing the camera for me. <laughs> uh, I was watching some other channel. I think it was Life with Mike. Red, please don't. <laughs> and he was showing, um, he took a picture of their grocery ad for the week. And I thought that was interesting to see what prices are in other places. So uh, we don't get a paper ad anymore. It's just all online. So I'm going to stick a picture, a screenshot of our grocery ad from our local grocery chain. And, uh, no, I don't need that, baby. And um, I'm going to put some Show screenshots them. of what? Show them. Show them this. He wants me to show you what his sister made for me. She made me a holder for my notepad. It says, the dog likes me best. And I've got a pen in there. She made that for me. Uh, back to my story. I also took a screenshot of what the price of, of hamburger is here at Walmart. It's kind of weird. <laughs> but anyway, um, I already intended to show you, sorry my eye itch is so bad. Uh, I had already intended to show you a screenshot of our grocery ad, just in case you were interested. But then on a local talk show Thursday, there was a man who has a barbecue business here, and he was on this talk show, and he said brisket, his, his price from his supplier, brisket has been being $2 a pound. This week it went up to $6 a pound. Uh, you know, that's quite a what an increase when it triples. <laughs> and so that's why I looked up to see what uh, hamburger meat is doing. Hasn't really hit the stores yet, but we have been warned that it's, you know, price of beef is going up because the workers are not there because of the virus. And so there's a shortage of meat because they can't keep the plants running, the processing meat packing plants. And so, since there's less meat, the price goes up. Uh, and I'm not a real big eater, but I do like to have a rump roast every now and then. And uh, we eat ground beef and chicken. I've got a lot of chicken in my freezer because we get the uh, boneless, skinless chicken breast for $1.99 a pound here. But... Um, let me tell you about the price of ground beef. This is wacky. 93% lean, at, this is at Walmart, for a smaller package is $5.47 a pound. The larger package, like 2.5 pounds, is $5.17 a pound. Okay, that's a great price. That's what it's been being. That hasn't changed any. The 80% lean, which is usually cheaper than 93% lean, since it has more fat, Okay, 93% lean, $5.47 a pound. 80% lean, $6.96 a pound. What? <laughs> yeah, that's in the smaller package. In the larger package, it's $6.65. So then I thought, that is weird. So then I went to our local grocery store ad. I noticed in the ad that I took the screenshot of, they didn't have any beef. Usually they have roast or a steak of some kind, ground beef, buy one, get one free, something like that. They, there's always a beef item on the front first page and a beef item or two or three or four on the second page. No beef today. And considering it's Memorial Weekend, that's kind of weird. But anyway, at the local grocery store, 93% ground beef is $6.19 for the same size package that is $5.47 at Walmart. The large, the yes, the larger package is $6.09, which was $5.17 at Walmart. 
I sent Casey to buy some hamburger from Walmart. <laughs> Eighty percent lean at the local grocery store is five twenty nine a pound for the uh, smaller package, and then they have an eighty five percent lean for five sixty nine. And they had a chuck roast listed for seven forty nine a pound. That is high for a roast here, but anyway, that's. How the price of beef is here, I expect it to change a lot in the next week or two. Um, when Casey did go get some hamburger, and she said they didn't have much. So, the meat counter was looking pretty thin again. So, I guess this is not winding down. It's not over yet, but alrighty. <laughs> it is what it is. Um, other than that... Other than me just having a stressful day, I'm about to go to bed. I'm just going to stop doing everything. The kid, the grandkids are in bed. They're not asleep, but they're going to be asleep here in a minute. And, uh, Toby is my schnauzer. He is wound up. Got to get him wound down. My little poodle, Molly, uh, at 8.30, she likes to go to bed. Well, it's almost 10. <laughs> she... 8.30 is her bedtime, and she barks at us if we don't turn the lights out. So we got to get that going. All right, guys. I will talk to you tomorrow. I hope you have a lovely Memorial weekend. Bye. Bye. <laughs>